Hello fellow collectors, and welcome to Gallic Gun Toys. Thank you very much for joining me in today's video. Today, we are doing another Dragon Ball Halls video. Uh, now today was pretty full on, it's Christmas Eve at the time of filming this, uh, and if any of you guys work in retail, you know what a slug Christmas is uh, in retail, especially Christmas Eve. Uh, so I was pretty stuffed today, I uh, came home for lunch, and when I came home, uh, I had these two uh, waiting for me. Uh, so that's the new Gogeta, number two and three. Uh, one is on the way. Uh, and yesterday I had the good fortune of being able to score myself the uh, new Grandista Gotenks, uh, which I was really, really in need of. Um, but I did already cave, uh, since I got this yesterday, I did already cave and open this one up, so we'll start with this first. As you can see, absolutely beautiful. Absolutely amazing figure. Uh, I have actually already shot my review for this, uh, but the Gogeta reviews will be going up uh, straight after this video. Alright, now I've been pretty busy tonight guys. I had plans uh, straight after work, hanging out with a mate, and I uh, have been itching absolutely itching to get into these uh, but I wanted to do this on camera um, I just feel it's more authentic you know your reaction or my reaction when you open the figure uh, when you first look at it that's really um, where it's at all right let's hope for no major defects so this is oh, what's this so this is uh, the brush three. All right. Okay. Looking pretty good. Straight off the bat. Doesn't look too bad. Let's get in on it. Okay. Okay, let's unwrap him. Let's get a look at defects here. Okay, and as for defects and major flaws, uh, I've only got like a tiny little bit of some sort of gunk or paint or overspray. I'm not sure what it is on one of the arms, but uh, considering what I saw a lot of other people had. Uh, I'm actually pretty happy with that. That's not too bad at all. I can live with that. Uh, really, really nice looking sculpt. Uh, can't wait to get this one on the review stand along with the next one uh, to review it for you guys. No major gripes. I think it's pretty good. I think it looks really cool. Really nice. Yeah, so yeah, really, really impressed. Uh, let's get on to the next one, shall we? I was really, really happy to uh, pick these up. Um, I did actually have a mate in the States um, hook me up with a Super Saiyan Blue version because um, he was already getting one uh, and he was able to acquire me one as well. So, I was really, really grateful of that. Yeah, so now I've got, I'll have three of these in my collection. Uh, the Super Saiyan Blue, the Base, and the Super Saiyan. So, really excited about that. Uh, Alright. Alright, that looks really, really cool. And actually... No imperfections at all. But I can tell straight off the bat, he looks pretty good. Give you guys a closer look. Really, really impressive figure. Really like that sculpt. Um, I was a little bit worried about getting, you know, three of the same figure. Because um, I really, unless it's SH figure arts, I try and avoid that. Um, but this 
I really like that they've gone with the different forms, not just um, just different tones of colours. Um, you know, they are different different tones of colours, but the reality is they're different forms, so I can sort of justify it to myself, opposed to having uh, four different versions of. Uh, say the ones down here in this cabinet here, the um, well, the rest of the Supermaster Starpiece line. So yeah, really happy with those guys. Um, I think they're really, really impressive. Um, definitely do a more thorough breakdown of them uh, once they're on the review stand, uh, which they will be on the review stand uh, straight after I'm finished filming this. So stay tuned for that video, guys. Uh, both reviews for those will be up uh, each day following this. Alright, and before the outro guys, I would just like to wish you all a Merry Christmas. Uh, because it is uh, Christmas Eve here, um, I'm sure a lot of you are spending it with family. Um, if you're travelling to see family, you know, stay safe. Uh, you know, don't take any unnecessary risks. If it's going to take you a little bit longer to get there, you know, just play it safe. Don't don't risk um, upsetting your families, you know, no one wants to lose a family member uh, around Christmas. So yeah, stay safe uh, and enjoy yourselves and have a really, really great Christmas everyone or whatever uh, holiday you celebrate uh, per your religion or where you live in the world. But as always guys, if you enjoyed today's video, don't forget to drop a like down below. If you're not already a subscriber, hit that subscribe button. Don't forget you can also follow me over on Facebook at Gallic Gun Toys. Thank you as always for watching and I will catch you in the next video. Bye for now.